you are highly welcome. Are you working right now? Are you in active service? Are you earning salary right now? What I mean, are you on monthly salary or monthly allowances or on monthly commission, weekly commission, daily commission? Again, you are not on your own. You go out in the morning to sit in an office or in location and at the end of the day or at the end of the month, you expect salary from your employer. This video is for you. Please, or you are either civil servant, public servant, or private servant. Whatever we name it, this video is for you. Please, make sure you watch to the end. Don't skip any track. These tips will help you to prepare for that day you will not be able to run. That year you will not be able to jump. That year you will start working with help of walking stick. You need to start preparing from now. Don't allow yourself to receive your gratuity before you start poetry. Most governments, most countries, most regions, their workers find it difficult to even get their remunerants, whatever they need, their benefit. Some of them will enter six feet before they even get their benefits. Some of their children will fight. They will go to radio houses. They will complain. They will go to state houses, legislators. They will go and beg for them to get their parents' benefits. That means even the person that work for it may not even be there to get it. May not even enjoy it any longer. Yes, some may be lucky as they are finishing, as they are retiring, they pay them. But irrespective of your region, I will advise you to watch this video. Nobody knows tomorrow. It is better you start planning from now. You are expecting retirement benefits. You are expecting gratuity. You are expecting monthly income. Watch this video. Retirement marks a significant transition, often presenting the perfect opportunity to explore new ventures and hobbies. For many, starting a poultry business can be an ideal post-retirement activity. Not only does it offer a way to stay active and engaged, but it also provides you financial benefits and at the same time, a sense of purpose. With the right approach, poultry farming can become a rewarding and profitable endeavor that enhances your retirement years. In this particular content, I target 12 reasons why you need to start poultry to help you when retired from active services. That is the content. Now, here are 12 reasons why starting a poultry farming business can be beneficial for you now so that it will help you when you retire from active service. Someone will even ask me, where will I start from? Your backyard is there. But make sure you consider the law of your region, the law of your community, the law of the environment where you reside. Make sure you are not going contrary to the law. For you, for me, I can start from my backyard. For you, if the law doesn't permit it, please consider a change or drop it on the comment section. I will also guide you on how to go about it. One, it's going to help you as a supplemental income. Poultry farming can provide a steady stream of income, supplementing your retirement savings and that pension. Number two, engagement and purpose. Starting a poultry farm now before your retirement gives you a meaningful active or active opportunity for you to get acquainted with this particular industry so that you will not find it difficult at your retirement. It also gives you meaningful activity to stay engaged and maintain a sense of purpose after retiring from your primary career. 
Number three is health benefit. Let me tell you one thing. If you're not into poetry, you, know, you won't understand this particular point now. Poetry gives you joy. Poetry gives you happiness. In fact, if you see how you feel enlightened, how you feel happy seeing your chickens running around, that morning you are gathering small, small, small from corner to corner. That tips they give you during your working time, that's your active time, you can be putting them into chicken on a daily basis. Within six to eight weeks, they will mature and you will gather the money in bulk. So, and seeing these bears grow before you gives you joy. And when you are happy, all your systems in your body, I'm not a medical expert. I am an academic doctor, not a medical doctor. But I know that once you're happy, every organs in your body will be active and work well. Blood pressure will not be there. Stroke will not be there. And other health issues will not be there because you are happy always seeing your chicken running around. Most of the times, you become a celebrity. So these farming activities can keep you very active, keep you physically active, and at the same time promote better health and well-being in your retirement. Number four is skill utilization. Leverage your managerial skills, your ability to control, your ability to organize in poultry farming. Leverage all your skills in the organizational and problem-solving skills gained during all your career in your service and put them into a successful run and grow your poultry business. All these skills you have acquired during the years will help you to run the poultry while you are still active in service. Poultry doesn't take your time. Even if you have 500 beds, it doesn't take you more than 10 minutes to feed them. I'm telling you the truth. 500 beds will not take you up to 10 minutes to feed them and still go to your work, even if you don't have helpers. And that one, number five, independence. Running a poultry farm allows you to build your own bones, making decisions that directly impact your success and financial security. Number six, community contribution. Poultry farming enables you to contribute to the local food production, providing fresh, healthy product to your community, healthy meat. Even most of your neighbors will even come to buy from you, and you are now their suppliers. Under one, number seven, scalability. Poultry farming can be scaled up, and at the same time, or down based on your energy levels and financial needs, making it a flexible venture for retirees. Under one is low barrier to entry. There is no feeling of form, there is no legal documentation. Just like compared to other businesses, starting a poultry farm requires relatively very low initial investment and simple infrastructure that empty room in your backyard that empty room in your boys quarter that nobody's staying with staying inside that vacant room can be converted to a mini poultry where you have few chickens number nine learning and growth continuous learning new techniques and staying up to date with industry trends can keep your mind sharp you will be active always because you are already in the business and you are also working. What you gain there, you implement it into your own poultry business. Why you are still active? You are still active. You are not retired and you are not tired yet. Number 10, family involvement. Poultry farming can be a family activity, providing opportunities to bond and pass on knowledge and skills to younger generations. Under one, number 11, market demand. There is a consistent demand for poultry products. 
Is it meat? Is it the eggs? Is it the feathers? And other poultry products. Even the poultry droppings is another big market for you. Ensuring a reliable market for your products. Making it a potential profitable venture for you. Number 12. Sustainable living for you. Engaging in poultry farming can promote a more sustainable lifestyle. Encouraging you to produce your own food and adopt eco-friendly practices. Sustainable living. Engaging in poultry farming can promote a more sustainable lifestyle. Encouraging you to produce your own food and adopt eco-friendly practices. You have heard from me. This is a very simple advice for you as you are still active in the service. Embarking on a poultry farming venture in retirement offers numerous advantages from supplemental income and community contribution, maintaining physical and mental health. It provides you a fulfilling way to stay productive and engage yourself, utilizing your lifetime of skills and experiences. With the consistent demand for poultry products, this venture can be both enjoyable and financially rewarding, making your retirement years more vibrant and satisfying. We stop here. If you have any question, please drop it on the comment section. And don't go too far. I'm loading another content for you as a civil or public servant. Don't go too far. And that content is coming for you. Thank you for watching. Please make sure you share this video. Let this video reach others. Many are looking for a video like this. Please let's share it. And at the same time, if you are a first timer, please subscribe. Activate the notification bell so that anytime I release an interesting topic like this, you will be among the first set of subscribers that will get notified. Bye for now. Hmm.